a Buyo kicks off fiesta activities for more than two years of the COVID-19 pandemic. And with the wrath of Typhoon Agaton, Abuyog Nuns are really blessed and remain steadfast for its love of devotion to its patron saint, St. Francis Xavier. That's why the town's 306th annual fiesta celebration was extra special. On Tuesday, August 23, the local government of Abuyog officially kicked off its week-long fiesta activities dubbed at the Slingunang Abuyog 2022 at the Abuyog Municipal Grounds. A motorcade along the streets of Abuyug made its way to signify the start of the week-long celebration. It was participated in by LG Abuyug employees, teachers and school officials from different elementary, secondary, and tertiary schools of the town. Meanwhile, ensuring the safety and security of the event, present in the vicinity were the uniformed personnel from Abuyug PNP, BFP, RHU and fire volunteers. The opening salvo also highlights the agriculture and trade fair by local farmers organization of Abuyog set up in front of the Putyukan San Abuyog. Visitors may enter their boat, take photos, and also buy their locally sourced product. In her opening message, SB member Honorable Janet Valida expressed her delight that after two years of pandemic, the town will be celebrating its fiesta with in-person activities and bring back its merriments. Mon is the first time to celebrate a fiesta they gathered together post pandemic fiesta celebration. So it is a gift na from pandemic na tayong nakapunta umaayong lawas. Vice Mayor Limuel Jean K. Traya also felt that excitement to finally be able to enjoy the Abuyo festivities face to face. He also encouraged the attendees to be as one united community in celebrating the bountiful harvest, diverse stories, and heritage of Abuyug. We have the Apple Mayor, the Mayor of Tabio J. Traya Jr. I now declare the Nikola Abuyug open. Meanwhile, Abuyug nuns and local tourists are invited to witness and enjoy the festivity with the amazing sights and lineup of events for the week-long celebration of Abuyog. It is given that Philippines has the most fiesta celebrations. In the end, we should always remember that we are still in the pandemic and being healthy and safe is a must. We should not forget that the essence of celebrating fiesta is not how special you celebrate it, but on how you give and have faith in God that everything is possible through His intercession. Reporting here at Abuyog Municipal Grounds, Urban Achilla, The Honeycomb News.